I'll have this at the end. Let me cut it open. Looks like mounting hardware. Some mounting hardware. And the actual item itself. Now, of what I read in the description, when you do plug something in, it's going to come on and off. If it's a light, like I'm plugging in, it's going to come on and off, whether it's daytime or nighttime. Oh, and that's where you change it. Okay. That's how long it stays on for. is the actual sensor itself that when it senses someone it goes off do a close-up look at the actual plug that's where the settings are four seconds one minute two minute probably gonna do uh, I need a thin screwdriver to change it, but I'll probably switch it to two minutes, maybe five minutes. This is the front plug-in device. The cable, I'll measure that now. Just to confirm, I think it says 15 feet or so. This is the other end, sensor. I'll probably use Velcro to mount it. The actual sensor itself. This is just the base. Okay. It gives you more mounting options with just this thing. So the base is pretty heavy. So I guess that's if you just want to put it down and keep it stable. So this is the base itself. Yeah, it's got like a magnetic, I think it has magnets here. Kind of, yeah, it's magnetic. Let's see the, either the magnets or the metal there. So let's measure the cable. about 75 inches I thought it was I'm sorry I I, I overestimated the try it they said six feet for the cable six feet so it's about six feet two inches and I have 
This actual plug is pretty thick and big. Biggest area. It's that big. base okay let me set it up where I want to set it up Turning this in the direction it's supposed to be turned. Uh, let's hope it's that way. It's a four seconds now. Um, yeah, so I'm hoping this thing right here is the indicator. And let me leave it for two minutes. Let's leave it for one minute. One minute would be perfect. Let's try it out. I'm looking to put the lights underneath, well, actually the sensor around here. I might change it to get these lights to come on. So I have four of them and I'd like them to come on when I walk into the kitchen area. So let's set it up. They are set on, uh, let me show you how this is set up. Right here. This is the plug for them, so if I turn the switch on, they're on as you can see. Off, on. So I'd like to set this on on all the time. Plug it in with the sensor and have it come on whenever anybody comes by. So I'm gonna put a piece of Velcro back here. So that, um, the edges out. Bring it as close as I could over here. So I use this. These are, um, I got these at Best Buy. <laughs> they go on special. I've done a video on them. They're great. I use them for different options for wiring, but for any wiring. And they hold up really well. And a hammer. And that's it. And they came out pretty good. So I hung it here. 
right? And it's back there, comes across. You can't tell from afar down to the back there. It looks pretty good, uh, if I say so myself. It doesn't look sloppy or anything. So let's see if see from afar. You can't even tell those things are there. Okay, so it's total darkness. Uh, we walking. We're walking. We're walking. Um, oh, good. It caught me before I even got to the light. So it gave me light even before I got here. Now I did uh, did a boo boo. I blew out one of the lights during the hammering right there. So I just have to get a new bulb for that. Not a big deal. But it's pretty cool. I like it. I like it a lot that, you know, it senses. So that's the sensor here. I might, I wonder if I should turn it sideways, but this should be good enough. Because um, it's a three, it's a 300, well, 180 degree sensing. So from wherever direction you're coming from, it'll pick you up and have it up front. So it picked me up right before I got to the light here which is a good thing because then you know I, I haven't gotten to the light to turn it on that turns on and it's the middle of the night and all I need is to get some light maybe get some water in the refrigerator uh, or something else it or just or something in the fridge so um, I like it I like the setup it's pretty cool it's uh, I'm happy with it all right I hope you like the video thank you there's only one thing with this sensor. It does not see daylight. So it's just a, a motion sensor. It's not a sensor that when the lights are on, it goes off. So it's not a, a nighttime only sensor. It's only a motion. So it's gonna go on whether the lights are on, whether the lights are on or off, it's still gonna come on. So it's gonna be additional lighting, even though it's very dark underneath there, so it's fine for us. But this will not turn off if lights are on. It'll always come on when it senses motion.